Hello everyone, welcome back to Math Mood. Here we have interesting equation 2 to the power x times 3 to the power x minus 1 equal to 72. Okay, how can we solve this? Of course, we can simplify this 3 to the power x minus 1 a little bit because we know if we have a to the power m plus n, we can write it as a to the power m times a to the power n. So we can simplify this using this rule. How can we do this? Let's write this 2 to the power x right here, and right here we can write it using this rule. So we can write it as 3 to the power x times 3 to the minus 1 power, equal to 72. What are we going to do next? Of course, if we have the same basis, the different basis but same exponent, we can write it in one parenthesis. So the rule is right here. If we have a to the power x times b to the power x, it will be equal to a times b all raised to the power x. So write this, you then this rule. Then we will have 2 times 3 to the power x. And you know, if we have minus in our denominator, we can write it with the plus sign, but in our denominator. So if we have, for example, 3 to the minus 1 power, we can write it as 1 over 3 to the first power. Okay, write this 1 over 3 right here, equal to 72. Just simplify this a little bit, 2 times 3 is 6 to the power x equal to, and of course we multiply on both sides by 3, and then we will have on the right 216. Real good case right now, because we know that 216 we can write as 6 cube, and then we will have 6 to the power x equal to 6 cube. And from here, the obvious solution, the obvious rule, because we need to write an equation with our exponent, x equal to 3. And this is one and only answer, so if you have any question, if you have any suggestion, write a suggestion in the comments. Thank you for watching and see you in the next videos.